this hand covers. This hand looks for his leg. I can see his leg, I can reach his leg. I step by step, I sit. BJJ for breakfast. Matt returns from rear body lock. So the guy has a rear body lock on me, right? Bunch of different Matt returns we learned. This, this week we're gonna learn another counter, right? From my position. We know we wanna shove the hand down to the hip bone. We wanna use the hip bone to break the lock. Doesn't always work. Maybe they got a good grip. It's not working. Another thing I could do, and this is just the old school wrestling move, high school wrestling move, is something called a switch, okay? It's basically where I reach back and grab his leg and I use that to switch positions with him. It's best done if we're moving forward. So maybe I get this and he's following me, he's following me. Anytime I could see his foot, I could hit a switch, all right? So I'm gonna walk my hips out and I'm gonna reach back into his leg and I'm just gonna keep walking my hips out until his grip breaks. And once his grip breaks, I'm gonna use this grip to turn the corner, okay? A lot of times they'll end up following you all the way down to their knees because it creates kind of like a shoulder lock on them, okay? Another time this is good is the, the um, mat return we learned last week where they kind of step off to the side. Yeah, they step off to the side to trip you. Well, look, there's his leg right there. Now notice what I'm doing with my hand. Turn around so they can see. Lock it up again. So the side that I'm gonna reach for, I'm grabbing his hand, okay? Because once I reach for it, I don't want him to let go, right? If I don't do anything and I reach for it and he just lets go, let go, I'm just gonna fall, all right? I wanna create that shoulder lock feel. So grabbing or covering here so he can't let go. And then I'm gonna reach back and put my hand into his thigh and I'm gonna start walking my feet out and putting, putting this weight into his arm. And then once the, I feel the grip break, that's fine. Let go here. And then we come up and come around. Again, gets me, right? Maybe we're walking forward, walking forward. Go down all the way to your knees. A lot of times they'll end up here. That's fine. We just grip, let go of the hand, come around to the back, okay? Same thing other side, if we see it on the other side, we're just gonna switch our hands, right? So now here, this hand covers, this hand looks for his leg. I could see his leg, I could reach his leg. I step by step, I sit, and then we come around, okay? Just trying to hook inside their thigh, put your hips out towards the ceiling, use that to create that shoulder lock leverage, okay? All good, we need another, no? Okay, let's run it, one, two, three. What's up, guys? If you like that, please smash the like button, tap the subscribe button to support the channel.